Today I'm gonna to be installing a Bigsby bridge on one of my guitars. If you don't know what a Bigsby bridge is, it's not a tremolo system, it is a vibrato system. There's a distinct difference between tremolo and vibrato. Tremolo I associate with dive bombs and crazy whammy bar stuff. Vibrato is a much more subtle sound and it sounds quite nice. I don't have a guitar with a Bigsby equipped, so I am going to change that today. I chose my 335, it seemed like the most appropriate guitar to install the Bigsby on. Kind of fits the aesthetic, I think, so let's install a Bigsby. Hold up. You didn't really think I was gonna drill into that beautiful guitar, did you? That would be silly. I got a Bigsby that requires no drilling whatsoever. Before we install it, we have to remove the strings and clean this guitar up a little bit. It's been a minute. Nice clean guitar. Let's check out what's inside this box. Booyah. But the question is, how do we avoid having to drill this into the body of the guitar? Well, I found this thing online. It's essentially an adapter kit to put a Bigsby on your guitar without having to drill a hole. According to the reviews, it's absolutely brilliant. A great idea, simply amazing and pure genius. Hopefully I can put it on without too much difficulty. Let's find out. All right, so step one is we are going to be removing this part of the bridge. Not get this thing off. Where did that just go? Did that go in there? Oh. Talk about dropping your pick in the acoustic. What an idiot. Oh, now that is years of experience right there. Don't try that at home. Next step here is to pop the Vibramate apparatus onto the area where that bridge piece we just removed is. It's got these nice felt pads so the guitar body isn't damaged. Next thing we'll do here is remove the strap button. All right, next we're going to Prepare this bad boy. Now uh, we attach it to the guitar. Now it comes with this custom made sticker uh, to cover this part here. I'm gonna put it on, I think it looks cool, but you don't have to. Last step here is to put this washer on and put the spring in. And that is our Bigsby. Now we just gotta string it up. Now normally stringing up a Bigsby is kind of a pain. You have to like bend the ball end of the string and, and use a capo to hold the string while you get the ball end of the string around these little spikes. It's not very fun, but there's this thing called the Vibramade spoiler and apparently it makes that process a lot easier. So let's find out if that's true. Apparently these little slots go over the pins. And I guess we gotta push this down. Here we go. Oh, there we go. One final thing before we string up, some slick nuts. It's, a, it's for the nut, the guitar. Drop a tiny bit across the nut like so to your desired lubrication level and then work it into those nut slots and it'll dry as you restring. Now we're good to go to string up. Underneath the Bigsby bar first and All right. 
right, we should have some vibrato action. Let's plug in, shall we?